April Cromer. I am here with Watch Kansas, and we're going to do an interview with Senator Mark Steffen. So we're very thankful to be here with Kansas for Health Freedom, and they are doing a Capitol Day where we've all been able to speak to our local representatives and other legislators about why we believe that freedom is not for free. So with that being said, uh, Mr. Steffen, thank you for coming here to speak with us. We really do appreciate that. My pleasure. I'm thrilled to be here. I, 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 and it's an honor to get to work for the people. It really is. And, and this is about truth. It's about transparency. It's about fixing a broken government. And like I said earlier to the Kansans for Health Freedom, <clears throat> it's time to take back control of our government. You know, we were working. We were, people like us were just working. And the establishment, the liberal left, and special interest groups snuck in and, and made a mess of our democracy. And their time's up. It's our time. And, and, and we take this back by hard work. We take it back by, by, by rallying around good people. Uh, everybody pitches in, everybody carries part of the load, and we end up with a better government. You know, today here in, in the Capitol was was perfect case in point. I'm on three committees, starting public health. I got to listen to the, the secretary, <coughs> appointed secretary, interim secretary of health and environment, just just run circles around the facts, around the truth. You know, you, you could get a real feel for how they falsified their COVID numbers. And then we heard about all these other programs and what, what the health and environment tries to do. They want to control every, every little aspect of our lives. And, they, and then it becomes all about money. Well, if we didn't get, if we didn't get you to do this, well, it's because we didn't have enough money, enough of your money, enough of my money. Right. It's just this incessant growth of the government trying to control all these variables that man was never intended to control. That's that, right. That's, that's God's business. That's right. And like we were saying before, the only thing that's going to fix this country, this state, is God. And that's right. That's why, you know, my my political mon political mantra is God, family, and true mm -hmm. conservatism, because yeah. that's how we fix things. But so then I went to the tax committee and got to listen to twenty. 22 year old companies begging for tax breaks. Mm. You know, just corporate welfare. And I'm sitting there saying, no, you're a 22 year old company. If you right. can't make it now, you don't deserve to be in business. Meanwhile, us taxpayers are not really getting a break. Like, no, no, no that, yeah, if they want a tax credit, $7 mm. million dollar tax credit. If you don't cut your spending, which we do not, then the average taxpayer like us right. has to make up that $7 That's right. million. Dollars. That's right. There's no such thing as a tax credit. <clears throat> is its tax shift, and it always gets shifted to the grassroots, to the, the people who crave freedom. So that's what I heard in, in taxation and commerce. Then I hear we're trying to expand co corporate welfare, and and again, it's just special interest groups that get their opportunity to feed here at the trough yeah. and get fat at the expense of the rest of us, the grassroots, the people who work. And, and raise our kids and, and, and make this a great state. We get preyed upon by by the establishment, the left, and, and the and the special interest groups. Absolutely. So that's that's what that's what I'm fighting for. I'm fighting for level playing fields. I'm I'm fighting for low taxes, low taxes, less government for everybody. That's how you preserve freedom. Yeah, I'm trying to I'm trying to get the Chamber of Commerce, the Kansas Chamber of Commerce, to understand that until you protect the foundational freedoms, they don't have a stable platform to have their their businesses ran. That's on. right. That's you know, right. they get caught up in, in, in this greedy concept that big business gets caught into and they want to tell us what to do. They want to take our freedoms away from us. They don't understand. They take our freedoms, they destroy their free enterprises. That's right. You know, and that's why we, we the people, uh, we realize that we, it's, we are the government. And so we elect individuals like you to protect our constitutional rights. And so I really appreciate everything that you're doing. Um, you're fighting for our freedom. Do you have anything else that you would like to say to um, just voters or to citizens out there that would, something they could do to help this cause? <clears throat> Stay engaged know what's going on, know who the candidates are, 
don't don't let the candidates fool you. A good candidate is going to tell you exactly what they stand for and exactly what they're going to do. And the ones that are just trying to get in to do what they what the special interests want them to do, they won't tell you anything. So so be educated, stay engaged, demand more, demand accountability, and and throw a fit when you don't get it. That's right. Well, thank you for joining us. Again, I'm April Cromer with Watch Kansas, and thank you, Senator Stephan, for coming and speaking with us. Hopefully, we will be able to talk to you more. I'll look forward to it. Absolutely. Thank you guys. Have a great day. Yeah. Good? Yeah.